I don't know if I'm gonna be vlogging, but I'm I'm off to a good start. Let's just say that. So um, that's my outfit. Sneakers. One of my track pants. I love wearing my track stuff, and this is one of my favorite pieces. And I just love it. I love this like eyelet detail, and it's got a matching hoodie, which I'm not wearing now because I'm just going to the office. Um, but yeah, I just feel like this is literally like my favorite kind of airport look or travel look if you want. Um, but yeah, I just feel like it's so cute. Look at that. Well, you guys have probably seen my bedroom a million times. So that's just like my closet stuff. I know, I still need to do like a, I don't know, a tour or a, this is how I organize my clothes. Anyway, so remember on Instagram I was talking about the um, Lipo bags. This is the one that I went with. It's a gold one and it is so bomb. Look at that. Oh my word, guys. I'm so obsessed with it. Look at the detailing here. This bag's literally so bomb. I love it. It's gold and pretty. And I'm so excited that I have a new one. Not that I don't love like my grey one. Because I have a grey one that I normally travel with. I'm actually travelling with a full size grey um, gray bag. And then this I'm taking as my carry-on. Because I'm just i spicing up my life a little, you know. With this carry-on. But yeah. Uh, no makeup face. Do you want to see it? Okay, so this is just the natural light in my bedroom. When I travel, I don't travel with makeup on. I used to, when I was a lot younger, I used to travel with makeup on my face. But as I've gotten older, I've become more comfortable with my skin and with the way it looks. And so I travel with no makeup. I generally put on brows um, and then I put like a good setting, setting gel on. And then um, I've just got a lip stain. This is by Clarence and it's so, so, so amazing. I absolutely love it like I love this lip stain look at that so perfect and it just literally stains your lips for hours so it's like perfect just without having to reapply any lip gloss or lipstick you've got some color on your lips and that's why I like it this is just like a little tea from Mr. P I'm wearing like a Victoria's Secret bra I love this detail it's just a t-shirt bra and then it's got the strap that says Victoria's Secret on it which is so cute <laughs> What is up? Okay, so technically nothing was filmed while I was in London because London was literally just a blur of work and busyness and craziness. So I really didn't have time to do anything. But I'm in Milan now and I'm just walking the streets. So I thought I'd just like take you guys with me. Like even if it's just like a few little snippets and I managed to only like get through like Let's say this is a two minute video. That's chill. Um, I just couldn't take you guys with me in London because it was just way too crazy and busy. But Milan should be a bit more relaxed and tame. The streets are so beautiful, guys. Look at this. Like everything is just pretty. This is my outfit. Um, I'll show you guys my sneakers because I bought them from Bershka or Stradivarius or something. Okay, so we've literally just come across like a Chinatown in Milan. There's like only like Chinese shops and restaurants and like this like wholesale kind of vibe clothing shops, which is pretty cool. Um, but I'm like get where I'm going and find what I'm looking for kind of thing you know what I'm saying um, but it's not so bad but like look at the fashion right you know like uh, okay <laughs>
Okay, so we're just grabbing a coffee. We're in the mall and got my little cafe over here. Looks so young. Um, yeah, so just like snacking on something in between all the shopping. Working, it's going good though. Sorry, I haven't vlogged much guys. It's been so busy. Um, good job, but it's good. It's been going good. And it's so hot here. It's so hot, but it's lovely. So, so, so we are going to the Bosco Verticale, which means um, vertical jungle. And it's this building here. I went through last night and it's so stunning. But I want to come back now in the day so I can get a better view because it's just so, so beautiful. Look at it. Stunning, eh? I'm going home tomorrow by the way, um, I come from dinner, I had, you would have seen that I had the vegan burger, it was so amazing, I had the spinach patty and it was really tasty and loved it, um, so I'm going home tomorrow evening, so I have this evening and then I have, it's probably about like 8 o'clock at night right now, and then I have the whole of tomorrow. And then I've got to check out of the hotel at about 4 p.m. And then I'm getting fetched for the airport about like 6.30. So I'm pretty much just gonna do my hair. Um, I have that peel, that um, Maybelline peel brow thing. The brow tint, the peel one. Oh, I'm so excited about it. So I'm probably gonna do that this evening as well. I was actually thinking like, um, so obviously my hair's just got conditioner. I didn't bring any treatments with me. I just brought some shampoo and conditioner um, because then yeah, I gonna probably have to wash my hair. And I left it way too long because I kept like delaying it and I was like, I'll wash it tomorrow, I'll wash it tomorrow. And like eventually it was so like dirty, it was disgusting. And like, I couldn't even dry shampoo the situation away. So I had to wash it today. And I'm flying out tomorrow evening. Um, but yeah, so anyway, so back to what I was trying to say. Um, I was actually thinking, um, a lot of people have asked me about my hair and I always think like, oh, I'm not an expert on stuff like that. Um, but I thought maybe like when I'm home at some point, I don't know if you guys would be interested in it. Let me know down below. But I thought maybe I could go through my hair like from beginning to end and like actually wash it, blow dry it, straight iron it, whatever, flat iron, whatever you want to call it. Um, um, so instead of me just talking about products, the hair products that I use, because a lot of people ask me questions like what do you use for this, what do you use for that, um, I thought it would be nice if I could actually just show you guys while I'm doing my hair, you know what I'm saying? Um, but yeah, but just let me let me know if you guys are like, interested in that, like, as I said, I'm not like an expert, but a lot of people kind of have been asking me about my hair, so I thought maybe that could be a cool way to do it, is to actually do my hair on camera and then talk about the different products like I'm so dodged with my hair though like I have to tell you guys like I just like dry it like this I don't like blow dry it I don't do that like at some point I was using like an air dryer and I was trying it um, but I don't often use that that's like only from like in the mood um, but most of the time I like just air dry it well like dry it like that with the hair dryer basically and then I just flat iron it and I pretty much just like flat iron my hair like once a week when I'm at home. But like if I'm traveling then that's like maybe every second day. Uh, but yeah, but anyway, I'm rambling on about my hair for like five minutes. Let me know down below if you guys are keen.
I just finished in the Duomo Cathedral and it was probably the most surreal thing like on this trip like it was so amazing to be able to go inside and um, see everything so yeah it was, it was absolutely amazing like I grew up Catholic so my entire family is Catholic and I know that this is something like you know my family would probably like love to see so yeah so it was like it was crazy to like actually just like experience it um yes yeah, so i basically got to get back to my hotel just now and so i'm just gonna try and do a little bit of shopping before that and then yeah cool